Greetings all, Frog here. Let's play some GeoGuessr. Uh, first things first, we are trying a bit of an experiment. I have the City Skylines soundtrack on in the background instead. It's uh, a lot more esoteric. I'm just kind of getting tired of hearing EU4 all the time. Like, I love EU4, but I want to, like, branch out. And I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that the Colossal Order people, uh, because they're part of the Paradox Interactive Publishing Group, or at least that Paradox does it, that they'll be cool with YouTubers using their music like this, too? I don't know. It's from City Skylines, though. The game is freaking amazing. If you haven't seen me playing it, I, you know, I understand that completely. That's fine. But it's a great game. Definitely go check it out. And I know you could buy the soundtrack separately and frankly the soundtrack is an experience if you like uh, kind of that whole atmospheric music you should definitely check it out it's it's kind of quiet though like I almost feel like you're never gonna be able to hear it in this video so if you don't hear the soundtrack a lot let me know because I it kind of fades in and out but I don't want to make it louder because then I'm gonna forget and then when I do something else it's gonna be a lot louder I don't know anyway hello we've been challenged so a uh, new contributor has entered the field and that contributor is one two three Mizzo and I'm gonna say Mizzo even though the I mean, wants to go Mizzo but I th it's just M-I-Z-Z-O and then the, like the person who who um is good friends with somebody that went to Mizzou I want to be like Mizzo but I, I don't know it's, I think it's Mizzo Mizzo I don't know 123Mitso has sent us in this challenge. This challenge, I'm loving this challenge. It's fantastic. It's great. So, somewhere along the way, he was paying attention, or she, actually, I don't know, either, um, is acceptable, or both. I mean, I don't judge. Whatever you identify along the, the spectrum is completely fine with me. Sorry, that deserved a, a, a soda drink for some reason. I don't know. Crisp, cool, and refreshing. Cold, crisp, and refreshing. It's not, though, because I, I drink it warm. Anyway... Uh, these are Harry Potter film locations. Excited about that. So I should theoretically be... Oh, well, yeah, okay, this is the Warner Brothers Studios then. In it. Yeah, that's very cool. Please don't content ID me. We're doing GeoGuessr. Free cash withdrawals. Can we, like, explore this place then? Daniel Radcliffe, of course, is everywhere. I'll be perfectly honest with you. Oh my god, you can visit this place? You can you can go to the Warner Brothers Studio tour? Is this in England? I need to go. Um first off, both both uh both of them were perfectly fine. Gambon and um Oh how Richard something. Whatever. I, I liked both Dumbledores. That was fine by me. Um Hermione, of course, I have a soft spot for Hermione Granger because I basically married her. Um my wife is not a redhead, but she is that kind of geeky, like, put, she still organizes stuff and puts tabs on everything. It's kind of really funny. Um, I had the biggest crush on Bonnie Wright. Huge crush. If you're watching this right now and, and you're up for it, just, just let me know. I'm sure the wife would give me a pass. I'm just saying. All right. Uh, cool. Can we only go in the lobby? Is that, is that how it is then? Yeah. Yeah, we can go into the commissary. It's cool. Uh, yes, uh, may I, I'd like a, a, a um, egg and crust sandwich, please. And um, a lemonade, which is fizzy. I think that's this stuff right here. Actually, that might be orange Fanta. It is crazy. Oh, wow. I'm just, I'm just going straight across the road, Pip, and I'm just like, oh my god. I'm telling you, the majority of my audience is American, like 60, 70% of it, something like that, which is surprisingly low as far as I was concerned, to be honest with you. Um, but man, you guys can look at, look at all these beautiful egg sandwiches. Look at them all. God, I'm hungry. Okay, anyway, so that's the commissary. Uh, we're just going to go back to the start because I'm too lazy to click around through. I can go out? Yes, I can. Okay, so we'll go out. Take a look from the outside. Yeah, very cool. Right on. This just opened not too long ago, did it not? I feel like it did. It's a hell of a bus. I'm not sure where this is. Like, it's, it's in England somewhere. But I'm not, I'm not entirely certain where this is. And it's okay. I 
That's very good. They got the loo right up close. Yeah, I mean, we're like, we're not going to be able to go anywhere inside of it, right? That's still cool. Um, it's, it's a cloakroom. I mean, it actually is a cloakroom, but Americans don't call them cloakrooms anymore because nobody wears cloaks, much to my chagrin. They're all coat checks these days. Even even Harry Potter has a Starbucks. Let me just, let me just point that out. Okay, so anyway, it's in it's in Europe somewhere. I believe it's not too far from London, but I honestly don't know that for sure. Let's just say it's outside somewhere like that. I was even farther out. I was almost St. Albans. It's in Leveston. Oh. There it is. That's gotta be outside. Oh yeah, yeah, you're not you're not taking the tube that far. I don't think so. You certainly train it though. Take the train to St. Albans? Oh wait, there's a, there's a train there's a train right here. Garson, you take the train to Garson and you walk. Probably just take a bus. I don't know. Here we are then. Harry Potter ebooks. Why wouldn't you just download them online? Oh, it's they're like gift cards. Fair enough. I do want to say this is this. Is, it occurs to me now, having put this online, this could come across as a sponsored video. This is not a sponsored video. Uh, um, all the marks and everything are, are owned by Warner Brothers, of course, or, or by... Um, probably Rowling, I'd imagine, man, or whatever company she set up. This is this is not a... Uh, that's me. I'm a Ravenclaw. Uh, this is not, by any means, an endorsement. I'm, they're not paying me to do this. This is me just being geeky about one of my geekdoms because I love Harry Potter <laughs> like I'm, I'm not gonna lie I still remember when um, I didn't I wasn't there from the beginning so like it was the third book by the time I finally got involved so my sister was huge on it and I realized every time I do a British challenge I, I slip a little bit sorry but every time um, my sister would talk about it I'd be like I oh, don't you know it doesn't sound me whatever I'm a huge fantasy reader like I read fantasy sci-fi all the time but I'm just like, eh, I don't know. I'll just King's Cross on you. Um, it's like, oh, do you, you know, do you really want to? Eh, it doesn't seem that interesting, really. I don't. Well, this is like the redesigned King's Cross. This is not what it looked like the last time I was there. Um, and so she's and my sister finally got me reading them, and they were fantastic. So I have the first three in soft cover, and the last four in hardcover. And I'll still remember um, the seventh book. I was in grad school by then. Um, and the book came out, when did it hit? Like a Thursday or Tuesday or something? And I took the day off. Sat around until it was delivered. I think it was a Saturday, come to think of it. I'm not sure. Whatever it was, I did not do anything but read that book all day. Read it from cover to cover, start to finish. King's Cross is north side somewhere. King's Cross, King's Cross. The zoo is there. King's Cross. This is gonna this is gonna seem a little bit horrible that I don't exactly know, but my defense is this: the defense. I've never been there over land. I've only been to King's Cross by train. So I'm gonna look for like big train yards and see if one of them says King's Cross. Wilsden Junction, okay. King's Cross is north of the zoo, perhaps. King's Cross. <laughs> where, where is King's Cross? It's on the Piccadilly line, pretty sure. King's Cross. Are you King's Cross? Nope, you're Holmesy. King's Cross. It's not by Wembley, is it? No. King's Cross. <laughs> hmm. I know it's north.
King's Cross. It's not over Barnett, is it? No. Edgeware. King's Cross. It's over Watford. King's Cross. I don't know. I honestly don't remember. It's in the north somewhere. We're just going to click over there and let it be wrong. Oh, I was looking too far north. It's north. Oh, uh, yeah. It's north of the city, but not north of the greater London. Yep, that makes sense to me. That makes sense to me. Why are we lagging? Is my wife watching? My wife's in bed, so that's not it. It's random lagging. Cathedral Coffee Shop. Parliament Room. St. Oswald's Primary. Oh, Priory. All right, that makes much more sense. Somewhere to load church. What was the filming for this? Oh, yeah, brilliant. Okay, so where is this? Yes, you're saying hello to the Google cart. That's very cool. Right then. The Beatrix Potter attraction, Gloucestershire Archives. Um, so where was Beatrix Potter from? That's the, uh, that's Peter Rabbit. That's the Peter Rabbit lady. How far can we go this way? Are you going to let me out? Oh, you might then. You might, rabbits, you might. Westgate Street. And Berkeley, fair enough. And College Street. All right. Oh, Gloucester. Is it Gloucester, then? It is. Brilliant. Where's that? <laughs> <sighs> Alright, well, we know we're in Gloucester. We just gotta find it. Gloucester. Gloucester's not exactly small. Is it Yorkshire? No. I don't know. There it is. It's, oh, it's by Cheltenham. It's in the Cotswolds. Right then. The Gloucester Cathedral, likely. Westgate Street. And Berkeley, indeed. Very good then. Two points. Come on. This is... Um... Morrison's clearly. No, what did they re did they record here? Huh? I'm not certain. West Coast. It's pedestrian bike route seventy eight. Town Center Sports Ground. It's the A eighty two towards the A eighty two, of course. Little. I don't know if the soundtrack works for you, because this is really kind of creepy. I like the music, though. Look, the A82 means we're in um, in the north, obviously. Because the 8s are up here. The 9s are there, the 8s are here. Over over Glasgow. There's the A82. Glasgow. The A82 doesn't go into Glasgow. So, likely we're somewhere else along the A82. Cool. 
It's for quite some distance. Oh, golly. Look at that. Boy, you having that? Does that go all the way up to... It does. Up to Inverness. Oh, I'm going to figure out what their center of then. Clog and Park. Fair enough. So let's say Powerball. Lockabar, Lockabar, FC. Oh, RFC, Rugby Football Club, probably. Clagan Park. Fair enough. Sports facilities, then. On ad. West Highlands College. Right. All right, me boy. That is the 82 towards Inverness. To the west? To the east. So we're going to the east. Oh. Nayo, check it out. Dual language signs. So, the 82 is actually that way towards the Inverness. It's going that way. And then, the eight, A830 is along this way as well. There's the A830. Fair enough. Are we in Fort William, then? There's the train station. No, that doesn't appear to be the correct train station. Look, I know how to admit defeat. The city thing is not working. We're going to go back to E4. I feel like we're along here somewhere, yeah? Malay Inverness. It's down this way, yeah? Cranlick. It's definitely the 82. The A3... or 830, rather is that way. Yeah, I think we're in Fort William then. There's a train station. There's Morrison's. Okay, yeah, this is the train station then where I'm at far on the way. Brilliant. Only one point then. Yes, thank you. So all the complaining finally gets me one point. Fantastic. You shouldn't have. Really, you shouldn't have. It's not worth it. What's this then? This is Gringotts. Gringotts. The heart of cosmopolitan London living. Coming soon, a luxurious new development of stunning apartments and penthouses that nobody can afford. Ha 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 Let's be honest. St. Edward. Designed for the... Designed for life. Joint venture company owned by the Prudential and Berkeley. Yeah. Nobody can afford to live there. That's rich, uh... Rich dudes. Yeah, brilliant. Well, we're in London proper. It's just an issue of where. I mean, maybe we're not. I think we are, though. Maybe we're in Yorkshire. Hmm. 
is the Yorkshire Building Society. Great breath, guaranteed. The breath company. Use the breath company oral rinse. It's $99.95. That's right, just for $99.95. Strand, WC2. Finger buffets. Hmm. Wait a minute. Oh, the bus is blurry. Fulham Broadway. Nah, I think we're in London. I don't think we're actually in Yorkshire. Maybe. I mean, maybe there's a Fulham York. The Royal Courts of Justice. It's very impressive. Yeah, we're in London. Random, random dragon. Like it. Look, just go for the love of God. Don't show me the circle if you're not going to let me click it. Belliard, when WC2, West Central 2. Okay, so West Central. Do, 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 West Central 2. Um, we were on the Strand. West Central 2. West City, actually. So where is the City of London proper? It's up in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah there we go. Um, where is the strand? I'm not certain, to be honest with you. It's Fleet Street. That's East Central 4. Oh. We went from WC to EC. There's Fleet Street. The Demon Baba of Fleet Street. There's the Courts of Justice. There's the Strand. Bam. Let's do it. You're gonna dip me that much, are you? It's not very polite. What? We're on that side. At the Australian High Commission. Fair enough. Hey, that is one, two, three mitzos. Mizzo? Mitzo. It's a mitzo. Harry Potter challenge. That was cool. I'm all for it. I'm a big fan. Big geek of Harry Potter. I know too much Harry Potter trivia. More things than I'd care to admit. So I'm not going to on screen. But um, the way to my heart is Harry Potter. It's true. And Bonnie Wright, if, if you're watching and you're up for it. Hit me up. The wife will be fine. I mean, maybe she'll be interested. I don't know. I don't know. I, don't know. I can't say that. I make a joke. This is what I do. I'm a comedian. <laughs> okay. Uh, thank you for sending that one in. That's how easy it is to get onto the, the channel. You just go to geocenter.com. You put in five locations. Those five locations become a link. And that link is sent to me on a private message on YouTube or Facebook. And it will then be put onto the schedule, onto the channel, just like this. And Tabitha beforehand. So... Please do continue to send in challenges. I love them. I have a good time doing it. I hope you guys enjoyed this one as well. If you did, click the like button. Consider subscribing to the channel to stay updated. Everything as it happens. Until next time, cheers.